just opened up, so I'm probably going to have to go in. Yes, sure do. It opened up as soon as I crested the hill back there. No biggie. They want me to go in. Probably over the scale itself. Yeah, over the scale itself. Which is no big deal. I only have about 10,000 pounds in the box. Heading to my second stop. Actually, no one in there.
I just love the way some truck drivers don't use their cruise control. I went to pass this guy and he sped up. Now he slowed back down. So let me see if he'll let me pass him. Or is he going to speed up? Hey all, I'm at the same stop I was at in Twin Falls last week. There's the bridge right there over the Snake River. They're about finished unloading me, so I'll be going over to where I picked up last week, get it loaded again, and hopefully make it down to Wells today. We'll find out pretty soon. Probably within two hours, I'll find out if um, I'm rolling or not. So my day got shot. I got to my shipper five and a half hours ago or so. And it took them over five hours to load the trailer. Their excuse was they didn't have the product ready. So that's how my day is in It's going to end here in about a minute and a half because I'm on personal conveyance to get to a safe haven and that's the truck stop down here because I'm actually out of hours. I'm an hour and 12 minutes over on my 14. And I'm actually not advancing the load. I'm going away from Reno actually. <laughs> I like three and a half or four miles. So it's all good. That's just the trial and tribulations of truck driving. Hopefully there's a parking spot here. If not, I'll go down to the one about five miles away. Let's see if there's some parking. Guys, I'm going to close this out.